Yeah, thank you everybody for joining this. Um, I will do this webinar on a monthly basis now because I want to introduce this 12 week challenge program to a wider audience. Some of you already have experienced this 12 week challenge program for solopreneurs. And I appreciate very much that you are here because uh, mainly I learned a lot from you, from your feedback and from the first three cohorts and also from the one-on-one -on -one programs, which I did um, um, before and which I still I'm doing. Um, so there are different ways of experience the 12 week challenge. There is a one-on-one -on -one program, there's a course, pro course program and new, I'm working on a book, it's coming soon. I have already posted about it. So I'm working also on a, on a book where you can experience the 12 week challenge for your own. My background is um, in academics. So um, I come from research, I come from university and research centers. And in 2015, or actually a little bit before, I realized that it's easier to make research in the private sector um, if you make your own spin-off, your own startup. And since then, I founded three companies. Um, my second and my third startup are digital um, endeavors. And so now I'm a digital entrepreneur and I'm also a family man living in Bolivia, in South America, coming from Austria. So my plan is really that a lot of people can work and live wherever they want, make a digital business and take their business yeah, wherever in the world they want to live. Because if you have a digital business, you have real freedom. You can really move wherever you want. And this is really um, the, the good part of a, of a digital business. But sometimes it's not easy to make it. And so I developed the 12 week program. Um, if you want to become a digital solopreneur or if you want to grow your, your digital business, then start now. And I have this 12 week program every week, one challenge. And now in the book, I will even increase it. I will have um, one short 15 minute challenge for every day. So each week, one topic and each day, one short um, challenge so that you really can work on it step by step and have a daily um, exercise. And then within 12 weeks, you have everything together to really boost your um, so your your digital business and earn money and then yeah can live and move and uh, change your life wherever you want um, and this even with a family so I know that um, there are a lot of digital nomads out there I know there are a lot of um, online entrepreneurs. But there are a lot also living alone, right? And if you're alone as a, as a single, it's maybe easier. But how to do it as a family, and this is really my goal, that also uh, families can do that, that you earn enough to support um, your family uh, with an online business. This is really the goal. The goal. And for this, I have four steps um, in 12 weeks. The first step is, um, yeah, this is the goals. I already talked about it, uh, the build a digital business, also making um, high ticket um, offers and giving families the freedom to choose the preferred place to live and grow. Now uh, we go into the four step program. The first step is really to prototype your digital business. And the main idea is really to find your unique selling proposition. Some people call it the blue ocean. I'm not, um, following the, the process of the Blue Ocean um, principle of the Blue Ocean program, but I like this concept and this idea of the Blue Ocean that you really find your individual business. Uh, I very often, um, I meet people and then I check the LinkedIn profile and they want support from, from my side. And then I see on the LinkedIn profile, I'm a graphic designer. I'm a software developer. I'm a content writer. I'm whatever. And then I say, um, but this is not unique. So you're one of thousands of 10,000 of 100,000 and you want to earn money, but you're a copy of somebody, right? So really find your individual approach, find your unique selling proposition. And in, in, in the startup world, the people know how to do it and they build business plans and business models. And um, there are different models for this. And I take the models from the startup world and do it together with my solopreneurs because if you do it alone as a as a solopreneur, it's harder. You do not have a team. You cannot make brainstorming sessions. 
And this is actually the idea of, of Tech One, that in Tech One we come together um, in the group, but also in a one on one coaching and help each other in the business modeling. So I work with startup concepts, like in, uh, in the startup world. I come from the health tech um, startup ecosystem. I worked with a lot of startups, built my own um, three. But um, I know how the startup world world, uh, world works, and now I do this for solopreneurs, for you know, for freelancers, for software engineers, for graphic designers, copywriters, virtual assistants, and so on and so on. And after they did my program, often they change their their LinkedIn headline, right? So first it was virtual assistant, and after that um, they have really. Um, yeah, um, a one-liner, a headline where in in one sentence you can find out what this person is burning for, um, this solopreneur is burning for, and it's different to everybody else. It's really a unique business, right? And this is really the the most important to prototype your your digital business. We work on on target audiences. We work on. Um, unique selling proposition. We work on a business model. We work on the pains and the gains. But the the main idea is that you craft your business that is different to everybody else's business. So you are not in a competition anymore. You are out in the blue ocean and you can fish with with not so many other boats, right? Okay. So yeah, it's about finding the niche, making it digital, and make it easy. If you have questions on that, um, please ask me later. The second part, and I like this very much, and it comes also from my research days. Um, I used cognitive task analysis when I was in research. Maybe I was the first researcher ever who did cognitive task analysis with surgeons. And the people told me, no, surgeons will not do it. They will not have time. But we did it. We did in-depth interviews, maybe 10 or 20 per um, research project. We did in-depth, semi-structured um, interviews, um, and it was like market interviews, right? We do not do a market analysis in a, in a quantitative way, like with polls or questionnaires. This can be done, but it's not so powerful. It's much more powerful if you really make interviews with maybe three or five um, pros prospects or um, possible um, clients which come from your target audience analysis, and then you make a cognitive analysis. And you have to ask the right questions. So it's really about the cognition. It's really about what the, the future clients need and not what they want. Because very often, if you do a market analysis, you find out what your possible clients want. But what they want might not be what they really need. And if you know what they need, then you can still sell them what they want, but you sell them not only what they want, but they, what they want and what they need. And if you sell them both, then you are in a much better position. And we called it also talking to humans in the past. Um, there is also a very good book about it. I also recommend this, but it's more than that. It's really cognitive concepts. I had uh, several projects also in the past um, weeks. And um, yeah, I will continue working on that also in my 12-week uh, challenge and 12 week program. And step number three is then, yeah, about networking sales, marketing and all that steps. We also use AI for this, um, but in the end, it's really about using my network of eight to 9,000, maybe 10,000, it's not everybody on LinkedIn, um, 10,000 people and finding the right um, people there for the first start, for the first um, step network and and starting to sell and for the most people in my program was easier to do it together with me um of course later they can do it alone it's, a, it's about solopreneurship but in the beginning it really helps if you do it together at least you get the support you get the sales script and um you really um go into the sales process into the sales funnel it depending there are different ways to do it as a solopreneur um, and we really work it out um, on an individual basis for each um, solopreneur business as it is needed. And then um, I'm also making an entrepreneur story. I have my YouTube channel. I do a podcast from time to time. So really working on a story of you as an entrepreneur, 
Um, we're also working on the social proof that you get your testimonials. In the beginning, this might be hard because you don't have your new business yet. But um, the idea is really um, that you get testimonials really from the beginning. We improve the automation and the artificial intelligence. And the goal after 12 weeks, latest after 12 weeks, typically it works already a little bit before um, that you can make your high ticket offers. And yeah, these all in, in, in 12 weeks. Um, these are the four steps. It's all about um, prototyping your digital business, making a unique business. You should not be a copy of somebody. Um, we test the market with cognitive um, methods um, based on my experience in research. We close the deals together and optimize it, and um, we speed up and scale scale up together. And um, in the moment, I have a network of more than 55 people. Um, we are growing you know, each week, maybe about one or two. Um, and yeah, these are the faces. Some of you are here in the session. You can um, yeah, tell those who are new about this program. And yeah, this is very important. We meet every week, at least once, sometimes even twice in different um, sessions. And we help each other and um, learn from each other. This is also a part of the 12 week challenge uh, program. One of my um, first um, participants of the 12 week challenge of the 12 week program was um, a virtual assistant from Vietnam. He's not a virtual assistant anymore. He's an operations manager now. He's very successful. And yeah, it was some, some work to bring him to the market and also that he can um, offer his, his services um, on the market. But at the end of the 12 week program, he wrote me, maybe you cannot read it, it's very small. But at the end of the 12 week program, he, he wrote me, I have two more offers to so think I might have to, to block new offers. So he was overwhelmed by offers. It was a good program because he had too many offers or eventually hire another virtual assistant. And this is to my knowledge, what he did later. So now he's growing something like a like an agency, and this was always his dream. So in the beginning, it was hard for him to find clients, and in the end, it was too many clients, and he was growing um, his 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 business. And now he's not a solopreneur anymore. He has maybe one or two um, employees or at least subcontractors. Right. So um, this was um, one very successful project, Kai T. She's still in, in, in my program. She's still in my coaching. She did the 12-week program, but now um, we are doing ongoing coaching. And she's really successful in the business of helping entrepreneurs in Germany to get public funding, but for private companies, right? Um, in Germany, there's a big market for public funding for private companies. And she's helping particularly migrant founders coming from outside of Germany because she lives um, for a long time now in Germany but coming herself from, from outside um, of Germany and helping them to, to um, find um, sponsorship and, and, and fundraising in the public sector. And we structured her business and all her approach in the 12-week um, program and the 12-week challenge. These are just two examples of all of the, the 50 examples. Um, maybe some of you can also um, tell about their examples later. And these are some examples of my health tech um, background in the startup world, because I told you that my approaches and my my concepts and my my ideas come from the startup world. And now um, I apply it to solopreneurs um, and we do it together in the Tech One team or a community. Yeah, so welcome to the 12 week challenge. If you want to be a part, I have the newsletter. I think some of you might have seen my newsletter and might have come because of the newsletter. I have a one on one in depth coaching program where you get really the whole program in workshops and in, in, in depth one on one sessions. We have these community meetings, we have also courses where you get um, one meeting every week and we discuss um, the, the, the weekly challenge together. I have material templates and resources and the book coming soon where you can make this program for your own. Um, if you want to know more about this, um, please make um, a meeting with me and reach out to me and we can do a one-on-one -on -one session and yeah, discuss your needs. But of course, um, we can also discuss it now. Please tell me your questions, your needs in your 
entrepreneurship business. And yeah, um, 